But the big story this morning, burglaries are on the rise in one Norfolk neighborhood and residents are fed up. Ten of your sides, Anita Blanton talked with some neighbors in the Ward's Corner in Talbot Park area. Anita, they've always felt their neighborhoods were quiet and secure. Uh, that is until now, Nicole. And this is a surveillance picture right here behind me of the suspects from one of the latest incidents. I'm told that these guys were arrested on Tuesday. But who's to say they were the only ones involved in what's been happening in this area? Considering what's been going on, no one's willing to take a chance and let their guard down. When Roger Sproul thinks of the place he's lived for the last 10 years, good things come to mind. Very, very quiet. Very laid back, out of sight, out of mind. But now, residents here know that's not quite right anymore. Someone's actually been setting their sights on them. I feel a little upset, a little mad, a little rage. You know there's somebody uh, looking at your homes now, watching to see when no one's home. Residents say it's unnerving, unsettling to see or hear about one break-in after another. But Jim McDonald, the Civic League president, says that's all the more reason not to be unaware of what's going on. And essentially what they're doing is looking for people who aren't home um, or perhaps uh, people who may be home and not answer the door and then they coordinate an effort to break in. There have been red flags before they hit. In some instances, these guys have actually offered to do uh, yard services like cleaning gutters, cutting grass, and uh, they don't have any lawn equipment or rakes or brooms with them. Besides asking for help from police, people in the area know they have to step up too. If it's easy for them, they're going to continue to do it. We're just trying to make it hard for them. We don't want them to, you know, frequent our area. McDonald has reminded people not to answer the door for strangers, report all suspicious activity, and keep their homes secure at all times. And Roger says, like many here, he's added cameras, bars, and more. You feel real violated. You know, it's yours, you worked for it, you paid for it, and then somebody goes and takes it not a good feeling. They're hoping by spreading the word, fewer people will know what that feeling is like. Uh, these suspects behind me were unable to get into that particular house, but if you know anything about the break-ins that have been taking place, definitely call police and to the residents in the Ward's Corner and Talbot Park area. Know that it's not just homes that you need to protect. You want to make sure that you're not leaving anything in plain view in your car either. Anita Blanton, 10 on your side.